Here is my Red C Max 250. I'm in week number three, and everything seems to be doing pretty good. I have uh, I just purchased a powder blue blue tang that you see there, and also a Chevron tang. He's in the back. There's my Rock Beauty. I purchased him also this week, and I have my little uh, Cardinal Bengal Cardinal. I'm going to go ahead and zoom in on some of the fish here. It's been a real fun experience putting this tank together and learning a lot about reef tanks and getting things set up. And that's my also my flame angel right there. It's a nice powder blue. It's got really good coloring. There's my chevron. Looks like he got cut by the other tang. We first put him in there. You can kind of see on his side right there, he's got a little, like a razor cut. He's a beautiful fish. In this tank, I try to go with a lot of swimming tunnels and uh, kind of created that. There's several tunnels for them to swim through. The rock right there where the blue tang is. There's like three tunnels back there. One where the chevron just went through. And uh, they can completely swim across the back of the tank. And as you see back there. Seem like they really enjoy going in and out of the uh, little cave tunnels there. Go back to a wide angle of the tank. Had some uh, brown allergy coming up as part of the cycle process and put some of the angels in and they've done a great job with clearing a lot of the brown allergy away. There's my two clowns. They're hosted in uh, the red bubble anemone. It's really neat that they really enjoy going in and out of the live rock. You know, I first put the, uh, put the two angels in at the same time. Uh, they seem fine. The one angel there was kind of going after the Rock Beauty, the one in the back. Rock Beauty is beautiful with his blue eyes. Uh, but he calmed down. And then when I introduced, I introduced the Tangs the following day, the Powder Blue Tang was the one who was being a little more aggressive, but everything seems to have calmed down. He just loves going in and out of the rocks. But they all seem to be getting along fine. The only issue I'm having right now is that coral there, when I first purchased him, he was a bright yellow. And he's kind of changing color a little bit, going more on the brown side. There's my candy cane, coral, recordia, green mushroom, some red mushroom, brain coral. That looks amazing at night under the blue LEDs. All the tank looks amazing. There's open brain, torch. Everything seems to be doing pretty good. I'm pretty happy. With my Red Sea Max 250. And I've just got the protein skimmer. I upgraded the pump on a protein skimmer. So that should be kicking in here now.